So in July 29th, uh, 2005, I was uh, involved in an IED blast uh, while I was exiting my Humvee while I was in Samara, Iraq. I have a concussion, basically. Uh, perforated my eardrum on the right side. Uh, I ended up having a, a brain injury uh, related to that concussion. So I get pretty frequent headaches. Uh, that can be very severe. And so I also have uh, some hearing loss and some ringing in my ear on my right hand side. I heard about uh, Warfighter Scuba through a friend of mine, Brad Balick. He told me uh, about the program down here and got me in contact with Nick Powers. So I had previously been certified through NAWI uh, for scuba diving. So I'm really looking forward to this week, uh, getting back into it again. This is a different uh, organization that's uh, teaching us diving. I'll have some one-on-one -on -one instruction uh, with a fellow veteran. And I think just having uh, good people around me. If I was ever going to do diving, this is the place to do it. And these are the people to do it with. It was a really good refresher. I mean, that stuff's use it or lose it. You know, if we went through uh, familiarization with all the gear, um, you know, changing masks and going through procedures, we have to change regulators and going to your secondary. I was out of air, they were out of air. Which regulators did we give them? Uh, we had an opportunity to do a uh, full face mask. I've never experienced anything like that. Just being there and not having to worry about chomping on a regulator, breathing normally, uh, and then everywhere I look, I'm seeing vivid colors was pretty awesome. It's going to be really hard to go back <laughs> to using anything other than those masks now that we've had that experience. You can literally walk out from the beach to phenomenal dive. The reefs are right there, the fish are plentiful, and they're all over the place. So many different species. It was, it was incredible to see all that. If I go somewhere else, I'm always going to be comparing it to the reefs, the experience, and the people that were here. And I'm glad that I uh, found the courage and that Nick helped me do that to, to come down here and experience that again. What I found uh, incredibly valuable is pushing myself to do things that I may not have already thought um, were something I'd be interested in, to being open to new experiences. The fact that I um, opened myself up to be able to talk to other veterans who had similar experiences. The serenity of being underwater in an environment almost totally devoid of the noise, the hustle and bustle that you get from everyday life. Everything's competing for your attention, cell phones, computers, the people you're with, traffic. Uh, but out there it's just you.